are going up to Chimney Rock State Park and we're going to do a hike that takes us up to an overlook and supposed to be some waterfalls. So if that's something you're interested in, keep watching because here we go. are so excited we are going on a hike today <laughs> I love YouTube because I find a hike and I'm like oh my gosh we have to go on this hike for the people on YouTube so they can enjoy it too <laughs> that's how I convince him <laughs> to go on hikes we are playing golf at TPC Myrtle Beach so in return I have to go on this hike. He's done forgot about that we are getting up at 3 a.m. on Wednesday morning for me too because we're going on a sunrise paddle tour. And we're going to a lighted golf range one night too. It's a lot of give and take. But we do that all for y'all. This road is super narrow heading up here. It had a beautiful entrance. We really don't know where we're going, but to start the trail, so just driving up this road, we'll see. Sure. <coughs> we're making it. Oh! Oh, that was scary. <laughs> Headed up there. The story of Chimney Rock and Lake Lure cannot be told without recounting the life of one man, Dr. Lucas B. Morris, who demonstrated what uncompromising vision and foresight can accomplish. The rugged beauty of Chimney Rock and the surrounding areas, so he captivated that it is shaped the rest of his life and those of his older twin brothers. In 1902, Dr. B. Morris purchased 64 acres of Chimney Rock Mountain, including the chimney and cliffs. Morris and his family owned and operated Chimney Rock Park as a privately managed park from 1902 to 2007. In 2006, the land was up for sale. Many feared the park might fall into hands of private developers, but the state and Morris family completed a purchase agreement in early 2007. All right, hey. A lot of stairs. Stairmaster Day. There is a lot of great trails. The outcropping is a strenuous 500 steps but all ages and fitness levels can enjoy the challenge with many places to stop along the way. As time passed, visitors did not relish walking the hundreds of stairs on the trail from the parking area to the summit of the chimney. In 1946, plans were drawn for the elevator to transport people to the top. Wow. Oh. I'm not as bad as I used to be, but that kind of, kind of get you. Mm. 
Are you okay? <laughs> I'll take one like right here and then I'll try to kind of scoot over and see if I can take one like there. Okay. All right. Big smiles, y'all. One, two, three. If you're scared of heights, this would not be for you. It's a, it's a little scary. Even though it's enclosed, Still. Chimney Rock, the 535 million year old monolith for which the park is named, is considered one of the most iconic sites in North Carolina. From its top, you'll soak in 75 mile panoramic views of Hickory Nut Gorge and Lake Lure. For the adventurous seekers, you can hike to the top of this towering 315 foot rock formation via the outcropping trail. Looking for a less intense journey, a state-of-the-art elevator is also available to get you closer to the top of the chimney, leaving just 44 steps to the breathtaking views. At an elevation of 2,280 feet above sea level, this mountaintop experience will take your breath away. The climb is well worth the effort. Exclamation point at the staircase leading up to the chimney, find the beginning of this trail. After climbing quite a few stairs, the trail levels out as you walk along the cliff and dramatic views. Stop at the Opera Box for great views of the chimney and Lake Lure. Continue up to see the Devil's Head and the end of Explanation Point. 2,480 foot for a nice gorge view. Today, the park continues to make improvements and has protected 6,892 acres on both sides of the Hickory Nut Gorge. Want to see the park differently? Stop by the Animal Discovery Den to learn about the wildlife that call the park home. Mm. I love that baby. She give daddy kisses, probably. Give me some sugar. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. We think we would have to because we gotta go up that other mountain to get to the waterfall. <laughs> does it say it's closed or what does that sign say? No idea. No. 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 I don't know where the active wasp's nest is. That's the thing. Oh, wow. Ooh. Well, we hiked up here to see this beautiful waterfall. It's a great hike. I would say that this hike is for ex for more extreme or well more fit. What would you say? The hike's not bad. It's the steps going up. Yeah, the, not bad. the steps were pretty bad. There were several people that, but they have a lot of places for you to stop and sit as you go up if you needed to rest on the steps. But it was a lot of steps. We'll count them on the way down. No, we won't count them. <laughs> we ate at what's the name of the place last night? Buxton. 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 We ate at Buxton's last night. It was so good. We enjoyed that last time we were here, and you can watch that video right here. Till next time, like and subscribe.